Hi there, thanks so much for joining me. My name's Kathleen. Today I'd just like to share a little bit about setting intentions. I don't know about you, but oftentimes I wake up and right away I hit the ground running in my mind, uh, even though my body might be moving very slow. And I, I seem to need a sense of what's next or what's here. And just asking myself this question, how do I want to be with this day? Helps me get focused. It's a theme that I can carry through my day. And in a lot of ways, it gives me a sense of direction. Not so much on the outside, but definitely on the inside. Because no matter what we'll be dealing with today or tomorrow, it's not the outside experience that matters. Certainly, it impacts us and affects us and some of us will be dealing with some challenging circumstances at some point in our lives and many of us are right now but it helps us respond to what's happening sometimes it feels like life is happening to us and when we set intentions it gives us the strength and sometimes the courage to decide how do i want to be with this so some examples of setting intentions might be Today, I will be focused and steady in my mind and my body. Some of us might need a little more specific support with that. Today, I will be aware of how my body feels and I will take deep breaths. So there's kind of an underlying resource that supports your intention. So that's one way of doing it. It can be as simple as just gently repeating this phrase, a phrase, over and over again. Like, I will love what comes my way. Remember, loving what comes our way doesn't mean we like everything that comes our way, but giving it the experience, the person, a sense of respect as if we could bow to it, meet it as it is, because we know that we have the resources inside to handle these experiences as we need to. Some examples of intentions that might be supportive of us right now. Um, today, I will reach out to others. Today, I will pause and settle into my breath. Today, I will drink plenty of water to support me. So that sometimes it can be an actionable thing that felt, helps us feel like we're taking care of ourselves and that we do have a say in how we want to be with this. And it is true, so much we won't have a say about, but how we respond to it, how we choose to be with it is up to us. So I'll just offer a pretty brief practice in kind of coming up with your own intention. You could be sitting, you could be driving your car. If you're driving your car, you probably shouldn't be watching YouTube, but if you're listening to this, um, that's one way you could do it. But if you are sitting and you're not driving your car and you'd like to close your eyes, that's an option. And just taking a couple deep breaths. Taking as many as you need to. And just taking pause to become aware of how you're feeling in your body. Maybe how your energy level feels, whether you feel steady or maybe you feel a little agitated. And meeting whatever is here with care and kindness. Just doing the best you can. Maybe enjoying a few steady, deep breaths. And then just asking yourself the question, what action or attitude will support me today? What inner resource do I want to focus on today? Maybe it's patience, Maybe it's courage. Maybe it is taking care of my body by drinking water and eating nourishing food. It's helpful to come up with a short and positive phrase. And then just repeating it a few times to yourself.
Taking a deep breath if you find it helpful. If your eyes are closed, you're welcome to keep them closed. Otherwise, maybe opening the eyes. So this is a more of a practice way of kind of tuning into what we need. This is not how I do it on a normal basis. Every morning I take my dog out for his biological break. And that's usually when I ask myself the question or maybe when I'm driving into work, how do I want to be with this day? I often do find it helpful to write it down, maybe on a post-it note or a piece of paper that you'll see several times throughout the day. Maybe you tuck it inside of your wallet or your phone. I hope you find this helpful. I hope you find steadiness and ease as you move through all that awaits us in the day ahead. And stop back in sometime. Let me know if you have any questions and take good care.